how to withdraw from Binance directly to your bank account. And I'm also going to be showing you step by step in today's video how you can also withdraw from Binance and withdraw your cryptocurrencies. So you can also withdraw your Bitcoin and set it to another exchange to a hot wallet like MetaMask, for example, or even, you know, set it to like a private hardware wallet as well. So if you want to do that, I will provide some links down below to some hardware wallets so you can keep your cryptocurrency and your private keys offline if you do want to get some hardware wallets. But most importantly, I'm going to be showing you how you can withdraw from Binance, which is what you came to this video for. So you're going to have to withdraw from Binance. So without further ado, let's begin today's video. And I'll provide a link down below in the video description so you can go ahead and actually sign up for a free Binance account so you can get started and follow along throughout this tutorial video. And yeah, let's begin today's video. All right, so as you can see on my screen, we are inside of my Binance account. And again, if you don't have a Binance account, you can create a free account by clicking the top link down below so you can sign up for your free Binance account so you can buy and sell crypto in minutes. So the first step we need to do to withdraw our funds, and I'm going to be showing you in today's video how you can withdraw your fiat currency into your bank account and also how you can withdraw your cryptocurrency so you can put that in, into like another exchange or into your hardware wallet or into like a MetaMask wallet or whatever you want to do. So if we go over here to wallet, we can click on an overview and if we want to like actually withdraw our fiat and cryptocurrency, we can click on fiat and spot. Once we do that, you'll see that we can actually go ahead and withdraw whatever cryptocurrency we want. So if I wanted to withdraw my cryptocurrency, so in this case USDT, I could click on withdraw and withdraw that. And I could do the same thing with my um, fiat balance right here. Now, if the, basically like the way to get your own fiat balance is to tr pretty much trade your cryptocurrency and sell that in exchange for your own fiat balance. So I'm going to go ahead and just use the ones that I already have in this balance right here. So let's just, you know, for an example, use euros because I have this right here and we can do this for, for again, whatever currency you want. So let's click on withdraw. And once we go to withdraw, we can choose the currency. So we can choose euros, you know, Australian dollars, USD, whatever you want. And as you can see right here, it's saying that it may take a couple of days to process. So that's just something to keep in mind. It might be 24 hours for some, you know, it really varies. So you'll choose like the type of bank transfer you want to do, you know, whether it's bank transfer, bank card, and you know, you're putting the amount you want to withdraw right here. It'll tell you the transaction fee. It'll, it'll tell you like what you'll get and it'll give you some information as well. So let's actually go ahead and put in USD for an example. And as you can see, it's the same thing right here. I'll give you some, you know, options. You'll put in like how much you want to like withdraw and the amount you want to withdraw, the transaction fee, what you'll get, and you'll press a continue. And once you press a continue to withdraw, so you'll obviously select the amount of like money you want to withdraw to your bank account. You'll click on continue. And then once you go ahead and do that, if you don't already have your bank account added to your Binance account, it'll give you like some information where you can put in your bank account information so you can get paid basically so you can withdraw your funds so that's what you do when it comes to withdrawing like fiat currency into your bank account now when it comes to cryptocurrency it's pretty much the same thing as well but you'll be sending like your cryptocurrency to a different wallet right so let's just say we're dealing with ethereum we can point in ethereum right here and click on withdraw and you'll see that we can go ahead and select the coin that we have and we can go ahead and withdraw to the new address so let's just say you have a hardware wallet address or a an Ethereum address on another exchange. You'll copy and paste that and paste it right here. And then you'll go ahead and basically withdraw your Ethereum. It's important to put in the correct address, like your correct Ethereum address, or else you could potentially lose your funds. And the same, obviously, you know, when it comes to anything with the crypto, just make sure you double check before you withdraw, etc. So obviously you want to choose like the network. So you'll put in the Ethereum address right here. And then you'll select withdrawal network. You want to make sure that you choose like the Ethereum network blockchain because, you know, if you choose a different like network that isn't within Ethereum, then you could lose your funds as well. So just keep that in mind. You can see on screen, i have put in an address just for an example. We've chosen a net network, which is going to be Ethereum. And we can put in the total withdrawal amount. We can put in max. So we can put in like the minimum amount or whatever you want right here. And you'll be able to go ahead and do that and complete the transaction right here. So I can just click on max for an example. And then as you can see, I can go ahead and withdraw this and send that cryptocurrency, the Ethereum to the given address if I wanted to, just as an example. So that is how you withdraw from Binance when it comes to withdrawing like from your bank account to an exchange to a wallet. That's how you withdraw money from Binance and cryptocurrency. So we went over how you can withdraw your cryptocurrency and money inside of your Binance account into your bank account. 
We also went over how you can withdraw your cryptocurrency and you know withdraw that into a different exchange or into a different you know wallet you know outside of Binance. So um, that's how you do it. If you do want to sign up for a free Binance account, I'll leave a link down below in the video description. As you can see, you can sign up for a free account so you can buy and sell crypto in minutes. And if you do want to learn more about Binance, I will provide a link down below to the official website so you can go there safely. And yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video going over how you can withdraw from Binance. And yeah, cheers.